Hi, my name is Ileana Chen and I go by Leah. My pronouns are she, her, and I'm originally from Irvine, California. Here at LMU, I'm a senior double majoring in elementary education with a mathematics concentration and environmental studies. This past summer in 2023, I was an intern for the Suwandi Foundation, which is a nonprofit organization founded by two LMU graduates. The mission of the Suwandi Foundation is to provide quality education to empower students to do what they love. And currently they're supporting an initiative in Bali, Indonesia, in which the local couple Putu and Agus dreamed of providing free educational resources for the children in their community. And to do this, the Suwandi Foundation has supported the construction of the after-school learning center called Yayasan Lokamawa Upadi. And after two years of planning and construction, this learning center just opened in May of 2023 and has over 170 students enrolled. Uh, currently, this after-school learning center is providing free English classes to the children in the rural town of Tulamban, Bali. But Putu and Agus really had this bigger dream and vision of teaching meaningful lessons that empowered and prepared the children in their community to become the best versions of themselves. And one facet of this bigger dream and goal was teaching about environmentalism, especially because the island that they live on will only continue to be impacted by climate change. So my internship title was to be an environmental science curriculum developer in which I developed 12 lessons that were each two hours long. And all of these lessons revolved around the theme of environmentalism with various topics that included the basics of environmental and sustainability principles and waste management. And all of the topics that I addressed in my curriculum were decided collaboratively with Putu, Agus, and other local leaders because we wanted to ensure that this curriculum was culturally relevant. And what this means is that all of the lessons that I was developing were specifically designed for these Balinese communities and specifically addressed community needs. So the environmental concerns that these local leaders were expressing to me in various meetings then became the outline of the content that I was addressing in my curriculum. And in addition to this, I was able to use my previous volunteering experience in Bali to kind of inform my, my strategies and my develop, curriculum development because I had a basic understanding of the cultural norms and needs of these communities. And beyond this culturally responsive pedagogy, I also focused the curriculum around being project-based. And this was really requested by Putu because she felt that the students were already receiving, receiving a really test-based and test-heavy pedagogy in their formal schooling. So her vision for Yayasan Lokomawa Upadi was to be a space where fun and engaging learning would occur. So to achieve this bigger vision of hers, I made sure to incorporate many projects, games, and activities in every single lesson that I developed, while also avoiding just heavy lecturing. And I really look forward to seeing how this curriculum will be implemented and over time adapted to best fit the needs of this learning center. And I do highly recommend internships with the Suwandi Foundation because I feel like I received a lot of support from the Suwandi Foundation team, both before, during, and after my internship. And I do really feel like the work that I was doing with the Suwandi Foundation was making a true difference in communities abroad, but also with professional development within myself.